arc just couldn't be any more beautiful, guys. Could it? Hey guys, Gunshy Mori here with another episode, or a first episode, because we made a mistake. Yeah, we lost our arc series, so we are restarting, but we're starting out here on Lost Islands, because I said once we got to 400, we'd get there, and we're about 25 away, so I figured may as well start it, seeing how we did have that accident. Um, it's all completely gone. What happened was, is I had uninstalled one of the mods on accident. I'd accidentally uninstalled S Plus from Steam, and I didn't realize it. So when I went and logged in to go and play Ark and record, I logged in, and the entire base was gone because it was all S Plus structures. So all the cryopods were gone because the S Plus cryo fridges were, again, S Plus. So they went with them. So yeah, anyways, we are going to just start out here like we normally would, get the stuff we need, craft the tools up as fast as we can. Luckily, we didn't even have to punch anything. So I do have my stats changed up here. It's not going to be overly powered. We do got auto engram still. As you can see, there was just a plus 15 there on health. Um, now that we do got that, I need a pick, don't I? Yep, I do. There it is. It's coming up. As you can see, though, I am tiny. I did change up the height of my character, just so that way it does look a little bit more fun. Um, and in the terms of explorer notes, we have no explorer notes, do we? Oh my god, it it did work. Okay, so if you guys are wondering what I mean by it did work, is uh, you guys know like how last time when you saw there it was like all those ones where it showed a. Uh, like, it showed me, like, the ones I'd already previously claimed. Well, apparently that there, that also breaks it when you load into the maps. So we wouldn't get the cutscenes. So now, I'm pretty sure I fixed it. But yeah. Um, I need to get flint. And I keep, and I just ran past all the stone I needed. I might head up this river and see where it goes. But heading inland might be a little dangerous now. I don't want to, you know, head inland and get killed by a T-Rex or something. This did see, say easy zone, though, and I am seeing that lighthouse. I might try and head towards that lighthouse and see what's in it. What do I mean? I can't head there yet. I have to get food, so I need to find a dodo. So once we got a dodo, we should start heading that way. Um, I don't... Ooh, what was that? Oh, it's one of them. Alright, so the plan right now, so far, is we're just going to get the three creatures off of... Uh, off of Lost Island right now. We might come back here eventually. Later on. To go fight the boss. But our main goal right now is to get the creatures. Then we're going to head over to Fenyordor. Get those three creatures. Which shouldn't be too hard. And then we're going to head to the island. And we're going to just kind of. Try and get as many of the creatures as we can. As fast as we can with Explorer Notes. So before episode 20 i want to have beaten the brood mother or on episode 20 i want to fight the brood mother on the island so hopefully this goes by fast Alrighty, i now got me some clothes now i just need to find some food i'm thinking about taking on one of those ichthyornis i feel like it'd go bad oh good thing we found out us because i was really certain we were gonna lose Oh my god, it's so hard to aim without a crosshair. Level 100 Dodo we took out. Nice. Alright, let's get some meat. Okay, that is perfect. Um, That's a Dilophosaurus. Do I? I do it. Um, let's... Alright, let's see what level he is first. Where'd he go? Oh, there he is. What level are you? Do you think I could knock out a 140? Oh no, I cannot. It's gonna kill me. Woo! Oh, 
bad time to lag. Who also just got on Steam? Ah! No, this was a horrible idea. This was a horrible idea. I'm gonna die. I can't dodge! Alrighty, guys, I'm back from the dead. <laughs> um. That did not go as planned. Ooh, Tech Parasaur. That's a nice one. I always like it when they get the blue in there. That's a 174. That's a max level Tech Parasaur. Or nearly max. Damn, I might come back and tame that. Our first mount is a Tech Parasaur. That'd be awesome. In a 180, though. Could I get it tamed? That's, that's my only one concern, is would I be actually able to tame it? Alrighty. Forgot. I'm only level 9. I'm no longer ne level 107, so I gotta take caution with this. Huh. Run away! <laughs> run, 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 run. Woo! Where is he? Oh, I think... Okay, we're good. Immediately lost him as we started running. He is chasing. I see him. Let's... We'll throw on a chibi just in case we do manage to kill an alpha at some point, I guess. Yeah, it's just a no it's just a knockling one. It's legit given to me every time I spawn in, so. Oh, I lost my Amargosaurus. God damn it. And my gotcha claws. Ah, oh, I had those two chibis. Those are my favorite ones. Hopefully they do another round of events, because I know this year was supposed to be the last round of events, but now they're putting Ark on the Unreal Engine 5 and other stuff. Oh, look, here's my body from when I was testing. Free me! <laughs> yeah, I was testing ar around, and I was, like, just flying around, just looking at the map, and I said, you know what, let's record on this map, and, yeah, create a new character, and that's the body that fell. I didn't realize I was that close to where I died. Okay. I f There's snow over there, so I don't know why I'm running this way. I feel like we're running actually towards the danger. What do I need for a canoe? Like, that's an honest question. I could probably take a canoe. I need some hide, thatch, and fiber. That won't be too hard. If I can get me a canoe, I can probably start finding a place to settle up. Or I could probably try and tame an aquatic creature. I could... No. I could try and tame a... No. There's nothing that would get me around the map fast enough right now. I could try and tame a Parasaur. Could. I know. I'll come up with something. Alrighty, I think I got enough fiber now. Let's see what level you are. I might be able to take you. Oh, yeah. Come on, get caught, get caught. Thank you. There we go, we got one. Um, It's axis for hide, right? It's been a hot minute since I've actually had to use tools to get raw meat and hide. <laughs> oh my, that's not enough either. What the hell? How much did I need? I need like 75, right? For a canoe. 75 and I don't have enough thatch. Okay. I don't want to fight you. <laughs> Immediately turn to the turtle and like, ah, I could get thatch. Or I could get hide. No, I can't. That thing would mess me up. And you know what? It probably gives me a, uh, what is it? Tough hide, because they are Carrick's better dinos. But that is going still. Um, we do still have TS editions, though. The Sunken World editions. And they did recently add a creature called the Albio. Or 
yeah and i am planning on releasing a video on it so yeah another review video for the t what was it that coming up the sunken world video coming up for their new creature hopefully i can get it out soon but they are supposed to be adding them in into the containers on other maps so hopefully we can tame them when we get to the island they're like uh what what, what are they I'd say they are quite like a wolf dolphin. So they look awesome though. All right, we got a canoe now. Let's get it in the water. Oh wait, I'm gonna actually cook up some food here before we go. All right, so we got our canoe placed down. I've already beached it so that way Oh, okay, so it's beach, so now I actually have to pick it up. Okay. Oh, so my canoe, I can just take it in and out of the water as I go. Alrighty, that's awesome. Glad I crafted one of these. I'm so glad I'm not using that stupid roll I started with last time in the series. If you guys don't know, last series, or last time, like on last episode one, I was only allowed to use stuff from the island. Then I went to Fenyordor and I said, fuck it. But, yeah, now we're allowed to use all that stuff, so as long as we have it, we're good. I'm going to get me probably about 30 meat here, and then we're going to head out. And we're going to go try and see if we can find anything nice to, like, settle at. Or a nice place that's secluded, maybe an island off the coast. I don't, I know there's a big one out that way, I don't want it. But there's, like, a bunch of little ones out that way I want to try and get. So... As you can see here, we're up in that little we're up in that little gulf there in the corner. So we got to go around the coast here, probably head up to the top, take a left, and circle back down the right side of the map until we find us a nice place to live. So hopefully that meat doesn't take long. All right, I got 27 meat, but here we go. I don't really know how to use a canoe. So, we're on our way. We're heading out to the Gulf. Ah, dude, what am I... Oh, okay. I thought my legs were poking through the bottom. No, I'm like sitting on my knees. My noglin's in front of me, though. That's awesome. We also got a little bit of an Amish beard going. You know, where it's, it's like where it's just on the bottom of the neck, but none of it on the face. It's, it's awesome. Oh, I'm so glad I've got one of these. I think you can get skins for them. I know there's a skin on... I want to say there's a skin on Fenyordor for it, but I know there's a bunch of skins from, like, the Genesis missions. Like, on Genesis Part 2 for them. Yeah. Wow. This thing's just awesome. Ready for some cinematic... Just... Ooh... This is my intro right here. Just paddling along in a canoe. That's a shark. Oh, it's the... Those are the hammerheads from the sunken world. That's awesome. There's some dolphins from the sunken world, too. Alrighty. Alright, we're kind of getting out here in the gulf. I will get back to you guys if anything interesting happens, but right now, I'm just going to enjoy the canoe ride. I had just hit the number one button, didn't I? I was right, guys. There is a lighthouse. Also, holy moly, it is deep down there. I want to see how... Just can't wait for that shark to come up and attack. Oh my god, look at how deep it is. Oh, if you guys don't know, I have that fear of very, very deep water. Especially if I can't see what's below me. And I can't see what's below me. Uh, this is why I don't do Subnautica. I actually did think about doing it. Stranded Deep, I've been doing. Like, just trying to get like the knowledge of it. But it's so hard. I've been thinking about actually trying to post some videos of Stranded Deep. But, yeah. It's just so nice out here. Anyways, I think if I look... Oh, I can't paddle and row. Okay. 
Yeah, but I think... We should be coming up on some of the islands on the side here soon. So, I have officially named our chibi fish bait. Our first... Well, I guess, yeah, our first chibi with a name. We had Mark the... was it? We had Mark the Margosaurus. We had Dave last time. I can't remember what Dave was. I think Dave was an Oglin. Um, then we had Nick, which was our Gotcha Claws. I don't think I actually used him in any other video except the Christmas special while we were at the Christmas cabin. Man, it's just fun paddling along, though. Ooh! Sword... <laughs> That's one of those fish from the Sunken World. I did not expect to see it. I guess they spawn quite a bit here on... Uh... Was it Lost Lost Island? I feel like that's the island I saw, but should I head to that one? And see it? I think I should. I feel like this island is not going to be a real island. So I feel like the ones I was seeing, like the bigger ones, are way down more. I don't know, but it's it's nice. Look at the view. Ark just couldn't be any more beautiful, guys. Could it? Here, enjoy like a minute of just what I've been seeing. I think that island is real. It's actually quite... F <laughs> this is like right on the edge of a map. I think I want to get one that's kind of a little bit more in. So yeah, let's do head along the coast more. But yeah, this is what I've been looking at. It's just peaceful. I'm surprised I haven't gotten attacked by, like, one of the giant fish or anything. Because they usually attack rafts. I'm surprised they don't attack canoes. But anyways, I will get back to you guys when I find something. Alrighty, guys. We have been canoeing for a little bit. Um. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> uh, I think we're coming up on the place where I saw those islands. When I was scouting the place for bases. I feel like it. Just feel it. Just feel it in my bones. Um, this is actually probably pretty dark for you guys as well, so... Ooh. Oh. Ooh. There we go. Game up. It doesn't look as beautiful as it did for me when it's like this. This looks, like, quite... Quite nice on the lake, you know. Paddle out with your girlfriend. You know, that weird stuff that they used to do in the 80s. <laughs> Alright. Um... But yeah, I think that the place I want is up ahead. The places I want are up ahead. Where those islands were. I think we have found the islands. Is it? Ooh, looks like that is an island. I'm guessing this is one of them. So we just need to find one. Hopefully not one that's too big to settle on. I wonder if that one right there in front of us would work. Not this one. This one, like, this one's big. Or that one over there. Looks like we got three islands. You know what? I'm going to go with the one with the rocks. That one looks like a small one with rocks. So I'm going to go with it. That one looks nice, though. There are definitely, like, several islands over here. But I think that's the one I'm going to land on. Oh, I guess we'll find out if these guys attack canoes. Um. I didn't expect to see one of those guys, like, in here. Honestly, like, look at how shallow it is. I guess they do spawn on Herbivore Island, like, in that thing sometimes. Is it chasing me? No, we're good. We're good. Yeah, I think that's not even an island. I think that's actually connected to the mainland, isn't it? It is, look. And then that one there is a big island. This doesn't look like a big island on the map. That's because it's not. <laughs> Alrighty. Uh, this is like a... That's a small, small island. I think this is the one we want. That was right the first time. 
I keep on trying to find it to make sure it's not attacking me. I looked over and there's like, oh, it's gone. <laughs> there it is. Anyways, yeah. I guess we will land on this island and we will see what we got. Oh, there's parasaurs and stuff. Alright, what was it? Left control to beach it. Perfect. I wonder, can I like place stuff on this? No. There are two pagos right there and I just realized it. Oh my god, if I pick up my raft and the pago steal my raft. That'd be fucked. Oh my god, I could not deal with that if they did. There's no way I would deal with it. They just come up and steal your stuff. Alright, let's try and get to the high point of this island. See what it all is here. Turn on! What up? Okay. So, this is... This actually it doesn't look bad. Um, There's another island over there. Another one over there. Okay. Uh, this is the highest point. We might not stay on this island if there's other ones around that are... Okay. You know what? I think this is probably going to be the best one for us. Because this is an entire island and not seeing any carnivores on it either. Not even Dilophosaurus. So we could probably set up stuff here for a little bit. And then when we come back after a while to fight the boss, we can use this as a operation point and all that. And go search the map and all that stuff for its stuff. But for now, I think we're just going to go with the creatures. And I'm going to get me a sleeping bag set up and me a fire and get ready for the night. Or, well, I guess it is day. I just paddled through the first night to get here. Uh, yeah, I guess I probably should, though, set up a, a bed and stuff. Shouldn't be too hard, though. Um, okay. We haven't leveled up either, so let's actually do some levels. I got 13, so I am level 23, technically. Let's go up to 200 that. Let's go up to 50. Yeah, let's do that. No, 220. 220 would work. Um, Let's go with that. Let's put a little bit into movement speed. Just so that way we can run around a bit faster. But yeah, this shouldn't take too much longer. Or actually, it probably is. This first episode, I'm probably not going to get any of the creatures tamed. But hopefully I can get me something. I know the cinema crops, the guys that we can get on our back, we might go for those tomorrow. For the next day. If I can get some chitin and I can find where they spawn. And I can get maybe some dinos for protection. We will go in that way because I do think there's carnos out that way. Or in land up there. So, as long as we don't die, we should be fine. I'm just... Should I just set my house up right now, but like, right on the beach? Should be fine. I think we should be fine setting up on the beach. Do I got enough to craft a campfire? I do not. Uh, I'm always sure on the things I need. Every time. Okay, got that going. Um, what do I need for a bedroll? I just need more thatch for a bed. And I'm going to actually do a hard bed because... A sleeping bag's a one time. If I can get an actual bed placed down, that just that's on a timer. So I can use it again and again. I was actually getting quite a bit of thatch. Um, I think I have that setting on where I don't need a foundation for the bed. So I will try that first. Yep, it'll work. So, if I... Say, you know what? 
do some fanciness. No! <laughs> I destroyed it. <laughs> I was just gonna try and place it under the bush and make it look like I was trying to actually... Yeah, it didn't work out. This one might, though. As long as I'm careful about where I grab and pull. There we go. And then I can say... Ah! Trying to use, like, bushes to, like, help set up a camp is, like, the hardest thing. I don't know why I'm trying to go fancy. I just want it to look nice. Here's our bed. Here's our campfire. We'll get some more meat going. And, yeah. I think we will lay on the bed. Uh, lay on the bed. But, yeah. I don't know about you guys, but... This has gone for quite a while. It actually took me almost three hours to get down here paddling. So, yeah. It took me the entirety of that first day and the entirety of that first night. So, I actually think this is like a really nice th setup I got here. I might actually just make this like the beach camp. Build a nice area, a nook, off somewhere, get a tent, all that. But yeah, I'm glad I actually tried doing this with like the bushes, like trying to make it look nice. It's like surviving. But yeah, anyways guys, this has been Gunshy Moray, and if you like what you saw today, please do leave a like and subscribe. We no longer do have a sub goal, sadly, but yeah, if you do want to hop in my Discord and drop some creature names, please do. As we now got a whole new cast of creatures that we can name that, uh, yeah, that we need to tame up. So, do be leaving names, make sure you do leave it at what creature you want to have named, like a pterosaur named Pete, like, leave that. But yeah, anyways, this has been Gunshy Moray, signing off.